Hey guys, this is a review, our first review try it so. Um, this is a review of the UTG AK-47SE Warhawk Commando. It's an AG, so it has semi-automatic and fully automatic. Um, so it requires a battery. Um, here's the gun itself. As you can see, out of the box, it comes with a tri-rail on top here. Um, and to aim down the sights when you have the trial, you have to look underneath the rail, which is actually really annoying. So we decided to take it off, and you can do that with a simple screwdriver. Um, and we also spray painted this woodland camo, which I think looks really good. Um, so I would do that. Uh, there's lots of videos on YouTube how to spray paint your gun in any camo you want. So under the gun itself, we're going to start up here. So this here is the Weirdly shaped flash hider, it, it's orange like everything else, and I would recommend just keeping it on, because when you take it off, it it's against the law, and it has to be, I think, a quarter inch in length for it to be legal. So I would recommend, like, duct taping it or whatever you're going to do. Um, the sights are really nice. As I said before, if you have the tri-rail on top, then it's kind of hard to look down, so I would recommend taking it off. It has a, a like rail here, the bottom rail that you can't take off, and it's really nice. Uh, you can put anything on there, like laser, I don't know how you do that, flashlight maybe if you're coming at night. Uh, the hop-up is located here. If you push it up, then the hop-up is on, which means at a certain distance it will curve up the bullet, and then if you have it off, then it's just going to go straight. Um, let's see, the mag, uh, it, when you buy it off Shorty USA, um, I would definitely recommend buying it off there because it is $140. It comes with two 370 round high cap magazines and they're windable as you can get. Um, this is uh, the switch and this is safe right here. The top is safe. If you go down one that's full and then down one more that's sunny. And the trigger is really responsive. Um, very good, in my opinion. Um, and then the grip, it's really comfortable. It's rubber, like fully rubber, rubber. And then we have sling mounts here and down here. And the stock is fixed, so it means you can't like flip it over and you can't shorten it and adjust it. But I think it's about the right length for, I guess it's like one size fits all. Uh, it's really comfortable on your shoulder there. Um, and to take out the mag, which would probably help people who don't know, for AKs, some bullets will drop out, but you have to go like this, pull this thing down, and pop that out, and then to put it back in, you have to like fit it in there, and then close it in, and then the high cap mag, you have to wind. So, I think that's pretty much it. Uh, as I said before, I got it off Shorty USA, uh, this is a Try Hard Airsoft production, and definitely... Uh, comment, rate, and subscribe. So, thanks for watching. Alright, so guys, this is just added on to the bottom, or to the back of the video. It's just us shooting the AK 47SE at this uh, Bud Light can here. So, we're like 10 feet away, so it's not that far. <laughs> so, I guess you can't really tell from this range, but it's pretty accurate, I think, at least. And the bullets go pretty straight. Thanks for watching.